It's a nice start there, fairly clean as they get moving. Looks like it's the Whittlesey runner in Lamb who's got the early lead here. On the inside too, Jackson Wiley from Wodonga is running very well. So it's Lamb and a bit of a stumble there from a Wiley, but those two very close. Gap back then to Papafotio from Essendon, but Wiley's coming through, he's got the lead now. So the Wodonga runners go on and he'll win this event from Lamb and then Papafotio from Essendon. So good running there, bit of a stumble from Jackson Wiley at about hurdle number seven. It went on to win the race, 27.68 unofficial time there. So good start there in the middle. It looked like it was uh, Aiden Saluni Kettle got off to a fly start. Also Fraser Simons from Bendigo Harriers hurdling very nicely as they come around the bend. So it's Simons leading from Saluni Kettle on the inside of him. There's some impressive hurdling here by those first couple. Reese Rigoni could be in third position there. And then we drop back to Merrick from Casey Gadinia. But Simons is flying through. Great running there. Looks like Saluni Kettle will get second and I think Merrick might have come through late to claim that bronze over Rigoni. So a clean start here. Looks like on the inside there it's Hunter from Old Zavarians who's got the early lead over Glue. So certainly the taller of the figures in the black and red distinctive uniform of Old Zavarians. Hunter striding nicely here. 28.05 is the state record set back in 2011 by Nicholas Milton from Wendaree. So let's have a look at the time here. Not going to be quite on that target, but certainly some good running from Oscar Hunter. Liam Glue also making good clearance. And he's coming through strongly to finish. So Hunter and Glue both safely across the line to take out first and second in the men's under 14 200 metres hurdles. <laughs> 